Well, what can be done is maybe encourage distributed generation. With distributed generation, you can encourage small players, small generators to build up, develop a new small generation along the, the rural areas. Then you can, uh, for example, you have a cooperative in which uh, we have uh, something like maybe 10 or so many, many municipalities. Then what you can do is to supply, let's say, one small municipality with uh, several uh, renewable generator. Then cut it off from the grid. So that municipality now will be supplied only with the generation from that renewable generator. And then it will then save uh, the transmission charges. So it will have lower transmission charges. Then what would, it will benefit also the grid because there will be lesser demand from the grid. So there will be now uh, lesser instances of yellow or red alert. And even maybe lower the transmission charges because there will now be lower demand for transmission lines. Now, with the distributed generators, you can supply that with solar and battery or maybe even in, in, our, in, let's say, in our eastern areas, there are so many mountains, so you can supply them with, with uh, mini, uh, micro hydro or even micro wind. So that's how I think will benefit uh, and solve that problem. Well, you need regulation because now that cooperative will have different uh, prices. If it sources from the grid, then it will have transmission charges. If it sources from the distributed generator, then it will only have dis distribution charges. So that's, they may have different charges for each municipality.